So, hello everybody, um, I'm driving to Tartu to meet uh, Barons, or uh, yeah, Barons as his nickname is. Um, so, yeah, he's uh, he came to Estonia for a school trip or something, and now I'm yeah, going to like going to meet him because uh, like when's the other chance gonna come to meet him and there's a roundabout so I have to put away my phone and I'm entering uh, a place uh, Buhia it's called so yeah okay <sighs> okay so this is Buhia there's a yeah, there are some garages and well, it's really dark, so you can't probably see anything. So, hello. So, basically, it turned out that um, Baron's, uh, uh, he's not actually staying in Tartu. He's staying like uh, 15 minutes away. So, I came here to this cent center, uh, I know where you could see it, uh, called uh, Lunakeskus. Which, uh, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go in there, take a piss, because I need to, and then I'm gonna head to the place he's at. Most likely I'm gonna beat him there, because he's just uh, leaving the central town, and I'm already on the edge of the town, so we'll see. So, here I am, park my car in a motherfucking puddle, luckily my feet didn't get very wet, and this should be the house. And it's really, and there's a gas station, and it's really weird walking around with a flashlight. I tell you that. I don't think they're here yet. Um, because there isn't a bus, and I think they'd be in a tour bus, but there, uh, there's a truck in the, fucking hell, it's right here. There's a truck in the um, gas station, but that's pretty much it. So I'm currently... So I'm currently walking to the front of the hotel. Oh fuck, I should put on my uh, blinker thingamajig. So I guess here we are. I can turn up brightness. Oh yes, I can. Oh, basically, these are the gas... Fucking hell, I bought gas for... Oh. Nah, it was the same price in Wieland, I'm pretty sure. So I didn't get ripped off. So I know, I guess I'll just be waiting in here, next to the highway, um, and here's a great start, the hotel complex is for sale, so if anyone wants to buy, then here's the phone number, if you're calling from out of a stone, then you should put plus 372 in front of it, and there's a web link as well, if you want to check it out, and Hestiana Kinnisvara Firma, which means Hestiana Real Estate is selling it, and me Hotel Complex, it means uh, hotel complex for sale. So here's a bus coming, and it has a Latvian license plate, and we're driving towards that direction, so I guess I'll follow, because why the hell not? Yeah, parents just texted me <laughs> that they're pulling up, so that's definitely them. They're not parking next to me, which is good. <sighs> and I wish them good luck getting off that fucking bus with all the bottles and stuff. So the doors have been opened. It's kind of awkward standing out here. But, well, you know. I'm awkward always. So Baron says he has to go in first, so I'm just gonna go and wait in my car. Yeah! Fucking puddles. My feet are wet now. So, now I'm in my car. And they are over there. And all this dark filming will probably look shit later when I look it on the computer, but... What the heck. So, um, I'm kind of getting deja vu here. Uh, because... Uh, because, how you say it, um... 
last week I went to Tartu. It wasn't even a week ago. It was five days ago. I went to Tartu and I had to also wait for a guy. So um, I won't be starting uh, to name names, but well, his name was Gert. So deja vu. I have been to this place before, definitely. Well, not this place, like literally, but I've had this feeling before. And the uh, parents messaged me that he's coming out. So, well, he's better than that guy Gert was because, like, he was inside for three minutes and last week it took, like, two hours. So, yeah, I'm gonna go meet him now. It is me. Hello. Oh, hello. How's it going? So, I don't know. Here with my car and stuff. You drive along? What? You drive along? Yeah. Hmm. You wanna go somewhere? I don't know. For a walk, you mean? I don't know, you can drive. I don't care. Well, we can go for a walk because... Yeah. Oh, my feet are really wet, like there are those large puddles here. <laughs> so, what did you do? Like, step in them? Oh, fuck. Yeah, because it's really dark in here. And I'm trying to film right here, but <laughs> it will probably look like shit later. Oh, you're vlogging this, huh? Yeah. I tried to vlog in a car, but it, <laughs> it was really <laughs> difficult to kind of like record while driving. You should have gotten one of those like holder things. Yeah. Or dash cam. Yeah, that's it. Well, I bought one, but it broke like in like two days. <laughs> How? What the fuck did you do with it? It cost like, I know, like 20 euros. It was a Chinese one. I think like the village is in that direction. We're staying on the fourth floor there, so... Where's the fourth floor? Um, it's like an attic sort of thing. Oh, uh, Because like, okay. I, where I sleep, the roof is kind of like, you know, slated. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I guess. So what hopefully I don't wake up in the morning and just like bang my head. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and you see it's for sale. Yeah, I, I saw something like that. I was like, I, I was trying to read that, but it was uh, too Estonian for me. Nya hotel complex. Yeah, that thing. Hotel complex for sale, yeah. We, we took a, a lot of pictures, like, there's this 360 camera thing. Yeah. Mm, uh huh. Like, I had to take a whole lot of pictures of that. Because the girls like, no, I don't look good in this one. Come on, let's do it over. <laughs> and, and so, uh, I, I was a victim of that. I was like, who the, who the fuck cares? Who's gonna see it besides us? <laughs> and maybe the employees. Yeah. And maybe they'll share it with some other people. And yeah. then it gets worldwide. I've just been speaking English to everyone. People understand it here, which is really good. Yeah. We, we were walking around in Tartu and some like college students just like came up to us and I don't know. They said to, like, they started talking to some girls that we were with. Yeah. And then they were like, eh, we speak English. Yeah. And then, and then they were like, oh, you're really beautiful. You want to exchange bubble gum for condoms? It was like, <laughs> like, why would we have condoms on us on the middle of the fucking street without any bags and shit? Like, oh yeah, I carry condoms in my back pocket like every day. I actually think, wait, I think I have a condom on me. <laughs> Not trying to like make a suggestion or anything, but I think I have one in my wallet. Dude, I was barely 18. <laughs> yeah, well. Wait, Four, 14 is legal in Estonia. Fucking hell. You like them young, don't you? Yeah, well, if it's legal, then do it. <laughs> and if it's illegal, then do it and don't tell anybody. <laughs> Jesus Christ, is that the mentality in Estonia? Well, yeah, I know. Some people are somewhere. Oh, and today was the first day when I legally drove 100 kilometers per hour. Oh, yeah, there was a road back in Tartu. Yeah. Area. Yeah, which has 100 kilometer limit because, well, in Estonia you need to have your licenses for two years to be able to drive above uh, 90 kilometers an hour. So even if it's if it's like a highway and speed limit is 110 kilometers an hour, then if you still if you're still a beginner, then you can't drive over 90. How are they gonna know though? Are they uh, just gonna like stop you? Hang on, you're driving a 100 kilometers in a 100 kilometer area. We need to check if you're if you've had your license for two years. No, because uh, it's mandatory to have uh, like markings on your car. Oh. Like I recently got rid of them. They're like, uh, like uh, how do you say, a green, uh, green uh, maple leaf on a white background. You have to have what those on your car. Maple leaf? maple leaf? Do you like like Canada or something? Yeah, like Canada, but green. 
And uh, yeah, and the student driver sign is uh, a yellow triangle with black edges and a black uh, square in the middle. I think it's supposed to be a steering wheel, but <laughs> well, it's really minimalistic. Yeah, in Latvia, there's like the sign, like you know, signs that have like limitations on you know specific, like at the work days or like you know yeah. holidays and days off. Yeah. And the fucking symbol for holidays and days off is like a red snowflake. Oh. And yeah. I don't know why. Is it the? It's like a red, like I don't know, star, like. Yeah, an asterisk. Yeah, yeah, it's the same in here. To me, it just looks like a fucking snowflake. In yeah, and the one for work days is like a hammer and some other tool. Yeah. I haven't really paid attention. Yeah, there we go. She she just locked the door. Yeah. All of it. I don't really need anything. I don't think I need anything either. I got absolute in my bag. Oh. That's always nice. That's that nice. shit, I bought a 0 0.5 liter bottle and it fucking cost, it cost 14 euros. Uh, well, absolutely, it's relatively expensive. Yeah, but it doesn't cost 14 euros in Latvia. Yeah, yeah I, I know that, because Latvia is much cheaper. Like Especially I, for alcohol. Like, the other things, it's, you know, maybe yeah, it's a bit more expensive. Same. Yeah, it's kind of the same. But so. then uh, you get to the alcohol section, it's fucking... 10 euros for anything. So this is the local bus station which doesn't even have a name. Dude, why are there posters? I know, that's the stuff. Mua... Hobo... Hobusesonikut. Mua Hobusesonikut. It means uh, horse man manure for sale. Horse manual? Is that Manu a... Manure. Oh! So it's basically horse shit. So why can't you shit yourself in like a bucket and all that shit? I know, so what else do you have? Hockey? Oh no, that's not hockey, that is cycling. Yeah, and uh... Some gay people? Uh, I know who those are. Some uh... Really... Yeah. What sepadut? It means base, I say masonry. Um... Uh, then you have like wood, firewood for sale. Uh, food potatoes for sale. Dude, there's so many things for sale. Yeah, well, and then you have summer like church thingy. What if like some dick just put a big ass poster over everything? Yeah, well, it's kind of unregulated, so. Oh, and uh, a, uh, a piano named Belarus. Yeah. And you have, uh, how to say, dirt, uh, gravel, sand. No, that's gravel. That's. Uh, Doesn't matter. Yeah. <laughs> this is the local, I don't know. The uh, local drinking spot in the night? Yeah, so you go when you're drunk? Yeah, and they have toilets on like most places, but most people, like when drunk, wouldn't walk there anyway. They would, like the tree is closer. Pere, 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 Eptik, which is a, a fucking medicine shop. Right? Pharmacy. Yeah, pharmacy. And Perearst means family doctor, Hambaravi means uh, dentistry, and Postkontor means post office. So I don't know why they're all in the same building. Like. <laughs> it's like, hmm, we could have it more spread out, but, uh, you know, we're just going to have it all in one place. So if someone has a hard time getting to one of those locations, well, let him have a hard time getting to all of these locations. Yeah. And there's a Kintru garden name. Yeah, I can tell that's from the ugly bees. Yeah. Or whatever the hell that, or and whatever it's hell that is. Like a really cold uh, bee. What? It's literally called uh, Kindergarten B. Like the name of the Kindergarten is B. The room's actually look pretty nice. I mean, from what I saw, I just kind of ran in there, put down my bags, and just ran out. So here you have consum. the co-op store. Yeah, co-op. Consum. Consume co-op video games. Yeah. Well, it's open until 10, like it's a village store, so I know how large the pla how large this place is. But here we have a building store, so... So yeah, there's the alcohol. Hey, don't film in there. We're gonna get the prices in the frame and they're gonna like sue you. Why? I don't know. It's like illegal or some shit to record prices in store. Is it to, to record prices? Yeah. But can you like write it down? In a notebook? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I, I know you can't film in a store because, like, like, it was some stupid shit that you, like, 
they have uh, like spent much money to develop uh, how everything is put in the store so you can't film it or else you're gonna steal their ideas or something <laughs> it was like really stupid just like the coffee with oil. well kind of yeah like the meme law of the eu some some uh, someone who owns a meme page in latvia he got like like he like he was almost sent to prison or something oh. for, for like uh how do you say it in english like provoking uh negativity and oh. racism or whatever well yeah if you have like a really racist page i don't know where you can go it's to not even that racist i mean oh. it's just like when pope was in town like everyone made memes about pope oh because i mean it was like the thing which like Did lutheranism you is like followed by 24 percent of latvia yeah so i mean nominally anyway yeah did you see the pope well, I saw him on TV, but I was kind of having a hangover, so... Ah. Well, I saw him in person. You were like, oh shit, that's the Pope! Yeah, well... I just call him an uncle in a white robe. Oh. Because I don't do religion. Yeah, well, he... Well, I was in Thailand, so I had a free day, so I thought, ah, hmm, I should go and watch his, uh, yeah. convoy. We also had a day off, which is why I was able to be hungover that day. Oh. Well, we didn't have, like, day off. Like, well, we had, like, I don't have uh, lessons on Tuesdays. Well, I have lessons on Tuesday every other week, so. So what, is like a Tuesday day off for you? Well, every other week. Like, uh, this week I didn't have school on Tuesday. Next week I will. How many? Like, one lesson. Fuck. Well, it's university, so... The sign's also, I don't know, kind of weird, yeah, so on. Yeah. Like those kind of signs, because oh. usually in Latvia they have also like a, another white outline. Oh. Like that one. Oh, okay. But, you know, it's also less detailed. I really love, like, when there's, like, a crosswalk. Yeah. Like, with the, the, the guy. Like, in Latvia it's just a random stick figure. And then in Estonia he has, like, a face shape, like a feet shape. Oh, well, yeah. Well, I know the crosswalk signs uh, in Latvia have like a more uh, like white, uh, like like more steps or whatever. Oh yeah, also that. like more lines. Yeah, Estonians have three. Latvia has like five or six. Yeah, it's five because like I, I think in Estonia, like just like the lines where he steps on is taken out. But I mean, sometimes they like make the signs without the uh, with like three lines. So yeah. So for all I care. It's not an official sign, and I don't have to obey it. Yeah. So if some old cunt gets run over by me, why am I to blame? It's not in the rule book. Yeah. Yeah, Absolute is like expensive vodka. Wait, how much was it? It was 14 euros oh. for 0 0.5 liters. Yeah, that's a lot. Like, you can get like cheap vodka for like 7 euros. Or... Um, I wanted to buy some cheap liquor. But it was in Russian and I also in, in Russian and Estonian and because I didn't speak either of those languages I didn't want to buy it. Oh. It was like five and a half euros and I was just like, okay, this, this might be like poison or something, I don't know. Yeah. Well I went to Latvia like last month and I bought two liters of vodka and it cost like a little over 20 euros. And like two liters? Yeah, because I bought cheap vodka. And I bought a bottle of Hector's because they don't sell it in Estonia. <laughs> Hector's is like the meme drink. It's, it's the thing you drink if you don't have any money to buy anything better. Yeah. Yeah, well, I bought Hector's a couple times and it's really good because uh, like you take it to a party and no one else wants it. <laughs> you get more for yourself. <laughs> yeah, no one's gonna steal their drink. Like if you buy vodka, then you put it on the table, you look the other direction, it's already, already empty. You, you, at a party, you sit next to a different bottle. Not that one. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a bus. Yeah, it, it, that, that literally says also a ladybug. <laughs> yeah. Tourism uh, 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 bureau? Like, company essentially, I don't know. Yeah. Old bureau, I don't know. So, yeah. You've been walking here, it's dangerous.
<laughs> oh shit, some guy. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you still fucking walk there. Uh huh. It was like, go for a walk. Yeah. Oh no, license plates. Uh oh. It's illegal. No, it's not if it's like parked in like behind the house. If it's parked on a well, like yeah. If, if you're not like driving on the road. Yeah, then it's illegal. Well, you can always say like, oh, they got stolen. Like if you have like insurance, then it's still legal. <laughs> and inspection done and stuff. Yeah. So I don't know, you're gonna go in or what? Yeah, it's getting pretty late. It's 22:22. Oh, okay. And, uh, you know. Well, you have an iPhone? Yeah. Oh, well, I have bought a new phone. Let's see, Samsung. <laughs> yeah, I saw it and got blinded. Yeah. So, I don't know if we're gonna go indoors then. Yeah, and drink vodka and get myself warm. Yeah. Yeah, as as you as you do. Fuck. <laughs> so yeah, all right. Good luck on your travel home. Yeah, thanks. Fucking give it more firm. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> so all right, bye. I'm gonna go home, and my mom's probably pissed. <laughs> Pick her up from the theater finally. <laughs> yeah. You should probably walk around that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I did like when I got here. Uh, I should probably walk around like this. <laughs> yeah. All right. See ya. Okay. See ya. Yeah, and see. Yeah, and see you in real life, like whenever I don't know. Yeah, okay, bye. Yeah, okay. That was fun. So I got a little hungry on the way home, so I came to this McDonald's located here, so you can see, and well, basically, yeah, let me give you a little review. Um, so, um, I don't know where it is better light. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm just gonna be here. <coughs> so, anyways, um, I met Barons or Christians, as his uh, real name is. So it was pretty interesting. I've never met the person. I met a lot. I I like was introduced to online. Okay. Um. So yeah, that was uh. A first experience for me. Uh, he was kind of a bit taller than I initially had thought. Um, so yeah, uh, talked to him for like some time, half an hour or so. And yeah, now I'm here. Um, just went to McDonald's, ate alone. Now I'm talking to myself in the car because that's uh, that's how normal humans behave. Anyways, I'm gonna go home now. Uh, it's like an hour drive, so yeah. Um, I don't know what else to say. I guess bye for now. Tura, mita munni? Oinu, vaadake number üks. Number kaks. Ja number kolm. Nahuisin ühel tänaval on rohkem ri... Äh, mis ring teid? Nahuisin ühel tänaval on rohkem äh, lamavaid politseinikuid kui Viljandis.
Türa Tartu, noh, ma saan aru suur linne kõik, aga nagu, noh, terve tänav on nagu Viljandi siis, või? Ma ei tea, ma ei saa aru. Ma ei saa mitte millest ka aru. <laughs> 